Corleen and I work with children. I'm reading two poems by Rogue Dalton in English. He's an El Salvadoran poet and a journalist. Uh, his poems were banned in his country during his, the military dictatorship. The first poem is The Warrior's Resting Place. The dead are getting more restless each day. They used to be easy. We'd put on stiff collar flowers, praise their names on long lists, shrines of the homeland, remarkable shadows, monstrous marble. The corpses signed away for posterity, returned to formation and marched to the beat of our old music. Not anymore. The dead have changed. To get all ironic, they're asking questions. It seems to me that they have started to realize they are becoming the majority. On headaches. It's great being a communist, although it gives you many headaches. Because communist headaches are historical. That is, they won't go away with painkillers. Only with the realization of paradise on earth. That's how it is. Under capitalism, our heads hurt and our heads are ripped off. In the struggle for revolution, the head is a delayed action bomb. In the construction of socialism, we plan for the headache, which doesn't alleviate it, quite the contrary. Communism will be, among other things, an aspirin the size of the sun.